After the sit-in carried out by specialists at the hospital, the Isla's news team spoke with the administrative director of the Departmental Medical Center to find out if any agreement has been reached with the doctors. At 8 a.m. today, specialists from the Clarence Lynn New Newball Memorial Hospital gather at the medical center facilities to stage a sit-in because, according to them, they have not been paid some months of salary. The situation of the sit-in is because, as we have been mentioning since the month of June, Sir Medic, which is the entity that is administrating the hospital, is owing the specialists a large amount of money. For this, the respective complaints have been made at the level of all the control entities, to the health secretariats and the government office and despite the fact that they say they are going to make sure that the payments are made on time when the context expires on January 31st as of today almost all the specialists are still waiting on their payment however after the sitting they had a conversation with the administrative director of the hospital and who has a representative of Sir Medic also made no aspect of the situation before the cameras of the latest last news Con los especialistas que son de no with the specialists that are under us with the EPS, we have already been carrying out a process of conciliation and payment agreements with them. Unfortunately, there have been some problems with the invoices and collection accounts. And in the reviews they are doing, before making the payments, they have had to request again invoices and accounts that have not been the same as the ones I have received. These are the problems that have occurred so far. There was no reason for the sit-in. The director likewise stated that some of the payment owed to specialists such as anesthesiologists and radiologists do not come from them but from third parties and that they did not know that they were without payments. Con RX Digital, que la empresa... With Rx Digital, which is the company with which we have the Rx service, they had already made a payment. I do not know in what conditions they are with the company because at the end of the day, they are our third parties and they had not informed me that the service had been stopped. Considering that a payment had already been made to them in the course of the past week and that additionally, already this week, they were scheduled with other payments. According to what was stated by some specialists during the day, part of the outpatient service was suspended until the inconvenience with the payments is solved.